Hey, what's up everyone? Danny Lightning back with another War Robots video. Me and my buddy Shane have a brand new YouTube channel where we're doing dumb comedy skits. Probably one video a week, sometimes two. Pretty goofy stuff, pretty funny. Um, if you guys are interested, there's a link. I'll put a link in this video's description and I'll do a card that shows up on the screen. You should be able to click that and it'll take you to the channel. Alright, today I got Nemesis. I got Ragin, we're going to play those two robots with my other things today. There is a skirmish, but I played it once and recorded it, and I got my butt kicked on the first two robots. So I went ahead and erased that part of the video. It's all old school Dashbots and Strider. The reason I say and Strider, damn it, I'm still, I accidentally clicked play this again, so. All right. I guess we're playing this again. Never mind. But anyways, whatever happens. Last time we were down a man and we uh we still won, which was cool. I'm gonna try and get over here. Rider's dash doesn't seem like it goes as far as usual. Alright, let's take out this Kumaho. He's got shotguns, but I got big guns. Right. We don't have any healing modules or anything on this. No mechanic skills. So once you once you take some damage on this one, you're taking some damage. This is old school, guys. This is old school. All right, next battle, I will remember to pick the correct thing. We need to get in there and get that beacon. Oh, whoa, get out of hay. No, no. Oh, I missed. Come on out, buddy. Come. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Dang it. That backfired on me. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and bring in... I guess Hiachi. Now I gotta get all the way over there again. That's crazy. It's too far away. These robots are slow. Except for when you dash. Those dashes don't get you that far. 400. Here we go. Let's try and beat up this. I'm out of dashes. Alright, that's not great. There we go. Look, somebody got him. I was expecting him to dash more. And I'm about to die. What I need now is the... I need some longer range weapons at the moment. There we go. I think these have a 600 meter range, don't they? Yeah, that's a nice amount of damage. These are actually pretty cool. I guess those are the medium version of the Zeus, huh? <laughs> I like the way they look. I like the way the... Uh... The projectile, the electric projectile, I guess you would call it, looks as it shoots out of there. <laughs> he didn't take as much damage as I thought he would right there. Alright, so this guy is going to come out and try and get our beacon. I gotta wait till I can dash again. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Wait, he got shot. Oh, I. How did he get shotguns? I guess there's different weapon setups on the skirmish. 
Both times I've had the same set now, so. M luckily, his shotguns must have been pretty weak, or he probably would have killed me there. Alright, I need to get over this way. And we are definitely losing this one. Here we go. Good shot, good shot. Got it. Here comes another Strider. He's pretty low on health, so... Alright, come on out in the open. He's got the energy weapons, so... Alright, let's try this. Alright, I died. I'm gonna bring in the Bog with the Scourges. Those dashes don't really seem to help you to do that. One more zap and he's done. Here we go. Grab this beacon. One thing I noticed though is on these matches, you never get that much silver. It's always like 120,000 silver for a skirmish match. Like, I don't care how good you do, that's about the most you're ever gonna make, I think. All right, so let's try and get over this way. I think. I was caught on absolutely nothing there, it looked like. I hate how long it takes for the dashes to recharge on these guys. The shields don't protect against rockets. whole bunch of them coming over here. Gotta be real careful or I'm gonna end up dying. And I am stuck again. I always get stuck on everything. I will tell you that. I'm stuck on those stupid houses. Well, I don't... I, what I want to know is why is there so much crap over here on this map? There's like a million things to get stuck on. Like this area right here is terrible. Terrible. They need to do something about that. 130, that was a little better than last time, but still not very good, so. Alright, let's go play another one. I'll make sure I choose Beacon Rush and not the Skirmish this time. Alright. I don't really like those. I don't really like the dash bots. I do like Kumaho. I don't like the rest of them. I don't know. Kumaho is faster. He's, his dashes recharge more. I think that's why I've always enjoyed Kumaho, but the other ones are just kind of slow, boring robots. Let's start off with the Nemesis. We'll go see if we can help somebody take Center Beacon. One thing I do like about Nemesis is he moves pretty quickly. He does do splash damage. I'm about to hit the space bar to dash, and I just realized, hey, I am not a dash bot. I think the Turans are a nice choice of weapon on here. Just, uh, I'm pretty sure something just shot at me. Oh, they've got our beacon over there. And I'm locked down. I hate lockdown. Lockdown is the worst. Alright. I'm gonna come in here. I guess I don't have my Al June. Um. Well. Here we go. No, you gotta be kidding me. He locked me down as soon as I got in here. Alright, whatever. I hate how it spawned you on top of this thing. I don't want to be up there. If it's going to spawn you on top, it should spawn you right inside of the damn beacon. And this guy is blocking me from the enemy for the most part. 
War Robots has stopped. Gotta love it. Alright, let me report this. Let me pause this. Well, that battle wasn't going very well anyways. It just kind of sucks for my teammates because now they're down a guy and they're pretty much guaranteed to lose after that happened, which that sucks for them. Sucks for me too. I hate when this thing crashes. That's almost as bad as getting wiped out by a whole, like, wad of whales or whatever you want to call it. Alright, let's try it again. Try it again. <coughs> Coffee went, <coughs> went down the wrong pipe. <coughs> Goodness. Alright, so what do we got there? That's a pretty terrible setup. <laughs> He had one rhyme, one orkin, and a little pin. The pin sucks. That's a terrible weapon. That's my opinion. Orkin's not very good anymore either, so... I don't know, maybe if he maxed it out or something. And somehow I lost my lock on. And I am locked down as well. Sucks. I'm out of my ability and I'm ready to die. Help me somebody. I'm locked down again. Locked down is so much bullcrap. That's one of the worst things they ever added to this game. Oh yeah, let's make a thing where people can't move. And I mean, nobody likes it. Except for when you're the guy that locked somebody else down, I guess. I I don't I don't own any lockdown weapons. You know why? Because I think they're for cheaters. I never once built a lockdown weapon because I hate them. I hate them. I don't care if like they do more damage than the other weapons. I didn't want that cheater bullcrap on my hanger. I'll tell you that. That hardly did any damage to that guy at all. Let's see what it does to this leech. I know a lot of that was splash damage. That would have been interesting to see how much a direct hit would have done to him. Something's shooting me from over here. Alright, it's getting back behind that. I can't hit it. My legs are damaged because I'm moving really, really slow right now. Like, super slow. I guess lockdown would be nice on this guy. You can't really aim his... That's the one thing I hate, though, is you can't really aim his ability. No matter what, it kind of locks onto a person and shoots right in the center of him. You can't, you can't aim it like you can with Orkins or something. Like, I try and shoot off to the side, and it still shoots directly onto him. And then it misses, because it's hitting it's hitting the uh, barrier, instead of going next to him and doing the splash damage. That, that's the one, that's the other thing I hate about Nemesis. I don't know why they, and that stupid thing right there, I get stuck on that almost every game. Or at least I used to. I wonder if this guy can do a super dash. I'll tell you what, he sure is slow. Alright, I'm gonna get up here and try and grab this beacon back. These don't really have much splash damage here. Alright, now he's in his, his last stand. Now he's going to die. Spaceship, come on. Give me a break. Spaceship is the biggest. That and lockdown are the worst. At least last stand, you can see that they have it, and they, you know when it's coming. I don't, re I don't agree with last stand either, but 
Well, I guess I got him. He got me. Oh, this is not going as... Not going super good this time. I kind of don't like these big maps, I tell you. I like this map, but... Too big. Too big. Nobody's even close, huh? They're all really far away. There's somebody. Somebody, I'm not quite sure how, but they're dead. Go up this way. I think I can get them. Nope. Let's see. This is boring. <laughs> Let's crawl up this hill a little bit. He's behind that thing there. There we go. Oh, crap. I guess these things, if you max these vipers out, they're pretty amazing. I'm too slow to catch that little guy. Yep, he's gonna get that. I can't even get. There's no way I can even get up there. Maybe I can climb up this thing, turn around, and then zap him a good one. I don't know. Oh, can we no longer climb up this thing? It used to go right up this. Ah, that sort of worked. So, I think Last Stand probably makes so he doesn't take any of that corrosion damage, doesn't it? I think someone's behind me, isn't it? No, that's still him. Sometimes it looks like those shotguns are coming from behind you. That's annoying. He locked me down. No, he's too far away. Alright, let's see what's over here. I guess we'll play one more after this. I'm not getting him. I'm slow. Are my legs damaged? Because I seem like I'm moving slower than normal. Everyone says it's okay to shoot the leech with the viper. It doesn't really seem to do that much. Someone killed it. I guess level 12. Mark 2 vipers really pack a punch with the corrosion or something but it's crazy expensive to upgrade these things not as bad as some weapons I guess I'm stuck on this dude I can't even go backwards because of this idiot robot tangled up. I don't know what he's doing. I mean, I'm trying to move backwards and I can't because this guy is tangled in my leg. I hate these, uh, that's the one thing I hate about the spider robots. They kind of get in the way of everything. And then other robots get in your way all the time.
I think we're gonna win this one. We're too far away. I really wish the Vipers had a 600 meter range. For some reason, I just always felt like they should have 600 meters, even though they don't. Alright, that wasn't too bad, I guess. Let's go play one more after this. Maybe I won something good. Let's find out. 250,000 silver. That's about my average. And you know, I keep... I was on a good habit there of using my boosters for a while, but now I keep forgetting. I'm only going to do one more game, so I'm probably not going to turn them on for that. Alright, went and got myself a nice new fresh cup of coffee. And we're going to go play one more battle. I keep thinking I can super dash after playing that skirmish, but this little guy doesn't do that. <laughs> I was real close to hitting the space bar right there. Space bar on my PC activates the ability, and I was thinking he would do a super dash, then I realized, no, no. Yeah, you can't do that. Oh, we got a purple shield up. It killed me, man. The whole team rushed in. We're going to go ahead and start off with... Uh, I guess I'm going to bring in the Nemesis. This is a good good spot because he can do all that splash damage. And there's a whole bunch of them over here. I almost blew up that area. Come on, what the heck? Check that out. <laughs> Unfortunately, he bashed me into that thing. I don't know, I, I'm not really sure what made me, made me jump, actually, but it kind of made my ability get wasted because I got pushed in right directly in front of that, so... That was a leech, wasn't it? Sure was. I'm still taking. Look, I'm dying because my team's shooting the crap out of it. Great job, team. Thanks for pretty much taking me from 50% to 20% health. That was very nice of you people. I mean, I get sometimes when they're shooting it, but. That time, no, it had full health. Wait till its ability goes down and then shoot it, guys. Thanks a lot, dummit. I couldn't get the cover because two idiots blocked me. You guys, I was having some crazy dreams last night. Real weird stuff. Like cool, but weird stuff. Something like you would see in an action movie or. I don't know. Very weird, cool dreams. I'm not sure if I killed the boss or not in my dream. I was up against the bad guy. I just remember we were going up and down through all these levels in this elevator and like having to find stuff and at the very end I had to take on the boss. Alright, that thing is going to kill me quick I think. No more ammo, it blew up my shield. And it did a death blast. 
Yep, I'm about to die, guys. Another death blast. Did I just break the shield? I don't know what's going on, but I'm dead. So. Time for me to bring in my Arthur. If new Titans come out, I'm probably just going to keep this one. I'm not interested in buying any more Titans. I really wish... I don't think they should bring out more Titans, honestly. Alright, let's take out the Ming. I'll tell you though, Arthur destroys Mings. That's one thing he's very good at. I ain't scared of no Ming. I kind of wish those two guns would run out of ammo at the same time. It's weird that they don't. At least to me that's weird. up and take this guy out that's a pretty tough Titan I think that's a kid he must have a lot of he must have a lot of uh, upgrades he is hard to take down and his ability is doing a lot of damage that's the one thing I do like about kid is his ability is pretty brutal oh well, I got one more robot left. And it would have died if whatever that was, except for it had the last stand. Oh, that's a leech. I, could, I thought that was a Ares for a second. Then I saw we had purple. Purple is no good. Purple is no good. Ooh, this is not... This is when I have a problem with the Al Junes. There's a couple of them. That one's got a very, very strong ability. Ah, he's got flamethrowers. Okay. I was going to say, his ability is crazy strong on that one, but he also had flamethrowers. That makes sense. So, that's pretty much it for this battle. Hey, some guy got some candy cane vipers. I kind of think they should have made the, the snowballs red that come out of those. I did win one of those and I sold it. And I almost kind of regret selling it. But just having one, it just, it just didn't look right if I was using it with another viper or something. I probably should have kept it. That's a cool skin on that guy, or paint job, or whatever you want to call it. Check that out, we got some- oh man, come on. <laughs> Alright. Pretty much it for that video, guys, so... We'll catch you all later. That's some really lousy silver payout on that one. But, what can you do, I guess? What can you do? Someone was asking why I don't show my stats. Stats of the enemy team on the videos. And I just don't really. Seems like a waste of your guys' time to look at somebody's stats. That's my opinion. We're in Champion League. Almost everybody has Mark II stuff here. So the majority of the players have maxed out or they're on their way to having maxed out stuff. Most everything's marked too. You'll still, you'll find a few, maybe one or two guys on the team that aren't, but everybody else is, I guess. All right, later.